understanding and collaboration in the future for the humanity and the planet academic today in the new century. Uh, with warm regards, my friends. Thank you, Luis. It was a pleasure to hear you and your eloquence, and I can see that your students are in very good hands. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Bye. Goodbye. Bye bye. So powerfully. We also gather in order to seek a deeper understanding of ourselves and our place in the world. We are very lucky this year to have Robert Post as the exemplar of so much of what these lectures have come to represent. I know they energize me every year, and I hope they energize you. It's now my great privilege to turn the podium over to the perfect person to introduce Robert Post. She's known him since she was a first-year student, is that right, in law school when he was a third-year student. So we're going to have the treat of hearing what the real Robert Post is like from his counterpart, Dean, Martha Minow. <laughs> law where we see so is no act his magic is no trick his life is imaginative his work is wise his pursuit of human values will instruct us all there could be no better lecturer here today join me in welcoming the one true Robert Post goodness, after introductions like that, there's no place to go but down. So um, I, I just want to say what a pleasure and an honor it is to be here today to do, uh, to present the, the Tanner Lectures. It's really the culmination of, a, of a, one's professional aspiration. And as I was uh, telling uh, uh, President Faust before, I feel like I'm doing it at the center of the intellectual universe. So thank you for that. Uh, and thank you, Homie, for, for having me. It's, uh, it's a great honor to be here. Um, so today, 